Cool. Good day. It's Rowena List, professional organizer and speaker of gettingittogether.ca. I wanted to give you a couple of tips today on photos. What kind of photos do you take? How many photos do you take and where do you store them? Well, you know what? Most people nowadays, of course, have digital. And so do you keep them on your computer and have organized folders and files set up there? Or are you the type of person that likes to print them out and have books? You'll want to decide which way works best for you and stick to that one way. No need to duplicate, that's for sure. That would be a fear mentality and we don't want that. Ask yourself, how many photos do you need to take to tell the story? I love the perfect example is for weddings. You know, how many pictures do you need of the bride walking down the aisle? One. How many pictures do you need of cutting the cake? One. You know what I mean, right? So ask yourself that question. And if you want to go back on past photos, take a look at all the photos that you have. Of course, that might take some time, but do it over a couple of rainy days or so forth. And just say to yourself, you know, do I know who's in that photo? Can I remember when that photo was? Or, you know, are people, their eyes are closed or it's blurry? And of course, eliminate those photos. No need to be keeping them. Give this a try, start off slow, maybe take 15 minutes every so often to work on your photos and let me know the results that you get. I look forward to hearing from you at gettingittogether.ca.